I mean, it's great. I mean, last year was huge for me uh, from an experience standpoint, getting to play with a lot of the upperclassmen last year. They really kind of left me in a good position uh, for this year. And I'm trying to take you know, a little bit of a bigger role this year, be more of a leader this year. So I'm really excited for the season. And you're playing a lot of second base? Yeah, I've been practicing at second base uh, pretty much all uh, off season and then in the falls at second base. So starting to get a lot more comfortable. Did you play that much growing up? I played a little bit in high school, not really much, pretty much third base. And then last year I practiced at second a lot. So. How different is it than third base? It's a lot different. At first it was a really big uh, kind of adjustment, but just because it's on the different side of the field. So kind of adjusting to that and, you know, double plays and stuff like that. It's been a bit of an adjustment, but last year Mitch Butler really helped me out. Uh, so pretty confident going in this year. How comfortable are, are you as a hitter at this level? Very, comf uh, very confident, very comfortable. I mean, uh, last year was kind of really big for me, just kind of gave me the confidence going into this year that I could have even better of a year. Um, so I know I have to be a little bit more of a run producer this year uh, in the middle of the lineup, but uh, I'm looking forward to it. What do you think you guys' depth can help you both early in the season and then you know, maybe on those Sunday games you guys kind of struggle with? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we're extremely deep. Our pitching staff is deep. Uh, up and down the lineup, we're deep. We have guys at the bottom of our lineup that really should be at the top, but we're just such a deep team that um, that's kind of how it goes. But I think it's going to help us a lot, especially with those Sundays. We struggled last year with it, but uh, I think this year it's going to be a lot different. We're going to start to get some more sweeps. Team hasn't been um, well, you know, as far as those rankings go, I don't know um, how much stock you can put into those. Obviously, we still have a season to play. Um, so, you know, we just come here every day practicing as hard as we can um, with the next guy up mentality. So, you know, last year I was injured, but our team did a great job of having the next guy step up and, and take my role. And, and so I'm just hoping to, to try and fill in the gaps wherever I can this year for the team. Coach said you were already um, pretty set in place to be your Friday starter, especially next week in Florida. Um, what have you been doing in the offseason, I guess, to prepare for that? I mean, I guess you had all last year, too, but... I mean, to already get a starting spot on a Friday. Well, you know, nothing's set in stone yet. Um, coaches are, are pretty uh, certain of that. You know, we have a lot of um, a lot of talent on this team. So, you know, if, if one guy is struggling, the next guy's just going to take a spot, like I said. Um, so, you know, as, as far as the roles go, it's just, you know, you step into whatever role the coaches want you to fill, and you do that job the best you're going to do. What are you doing to try to stay, like, continue to stay healthy? Um, you know, my rehab process um, was pretty elaborate over the off season. Um, so I've continued to do certain stretches, flexibility, things like that, um, trying to maintain my strength as, as best I can. So Jack, for you then, how encouraging or what are you looking forward to most when you open up this year? Uh, I'm most excited to just travel with the team again. You know, that's something that I, I missed out on last year, not getting to travel. Um, and there's really a team element. You know, you're on a baseball team, but if you're not traveling, you kind of miss out on that on that team aspect, you know, bonding with, with the other guys. So I'm just excited for that to start up again. Um, and, you know, we get to travel so, to some pretty cool places, so I'm excited for that. What would it mean, though, to be the Friday, the Friday show? I mean, it would, it would mean a lot. Um, there are a lot of of important guys who have, have come before me and you know set the precedent on, on what's expected and you know what our job is so you know just to continue with that legacy. How's your arm feel and um, you know you hitting the below you want to and everything? Yeah absolutely everything's back to 100% um, I'm just excited to get back out there and you know show show the team what I can do. How much of that recovery process is mental? Um, I mean it's hard to put a number on it I mean, lower than 100% because everything you do is, I mean, in the offseason when you're rehabbing, you're alone. So everything that you do is, I mean, nobody's there checking up on you, anything like that. So it's just on you to make sure that you're getting the work in that you need to do. And then you just hope that down the road that's going to pay off for you. Yeah. I mean, I was just going what did you learn? You can't get too far out ahead of ourselves. You got to take every game one game at a time and just um, make sure that you're focusing every, every day. What do you think you need to do to improve away from banks? You guys are so good at home. Mm -hmm. Last couple years at least, it's been kind of a struggle on the road. Is there anything you can take from your home games into, into some of those road series? Um, I would say that it's just, I think the biggest thing that will help us is our depth again, just because, especially with our pitching staff, we've added a bunch of guys coming back from injuries, um, just guys getting another year of experience or guys coming in um, freshly. So. I think just that overall pitching depth will help us the most because we won't have guys kind of falling off towards the end, getting tired, stuff like that. Um, we'll always have that, that backup to, to always have them in there. So I think that, that'll be the biggest thing for us this year. And the fact that you guys haven't made the NCAA tournament for the last two years, does that put even more of an emphasis on it this year for you? On what, making the tournament? Yeah. Making um, the <clears throat> yeah, I think especially too, we've got, we know that we've got the talent to do it. We put in the work, put in the effort, all that stuff. And we know that whoever we play, we can compete with. We're not going to be, not going to be afraid or scared of anyone we play. We can, the nine that we have out there can play against any nine out there. So.
Um, I think especially with this year with all the depth and the, and the age that we have, juniors and seniors, I think that we have a high, high level of confidence going into the season. That's pretty much the level of expectation here now, right? Under yeah. yeah, I would say so for sure. We, uh, we always go in, we're always expecting to win. I think we, um, we tend we tend to lean on our side. I mean, no matter again, it's just, no matter who we play, we're we're always going to be in favor on our side. We know that we're, the work that we put in and the amount of talent that we've got this year. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Well, a lot to live up to. Just... Coach Heller talked about the strength and depth of this bullpen. What are you seeing there? Yeah, I mean, we're all really excited about it. We got a lot of guys this year that have made a ton of strides. First guy to come to mind is Hunter Lee, Drew Irvine. They've made a ton of strides. I've been very impressed with everything they've showed us the last couple weeks. And a lot of guys stayed back over winter break and worked out here. And you saw the work they put in. It's kind of paying off now, so we're really excited about it. How much better is the staff overall, the, the, just the whole pitching group, than last year? I'd say it's a lot better. I'm, I'm pretty confident a lot of guys. And from the time I've been here, it's probably the best that I've seen since I've been here. And we're excited to the top to bottom what we got. Just deeper? Yeah, much deeper. Much deeper. We got a lot of options. A bunch of guys that can kind of do anything they're asked of. There's no guys that are kind of pigeonholed into a certain role. So we have a lot of options anyway. And you're finally healthy. Yes, we're all very healthy, which is the biggest thing. Uh, we've been we've got a lot of stuff in line right now to keep us healthy. We got a lot of strength stuff going on with our shoulders, core, and stuff like that. So we're we're excited. You find yourself in a leadership role, and, and what does that entail? Yeah, definitely. I feel like I I've been a leader for a couple of years now, and now this year I kind of have the captain uh, tag on me. So it feels good to be the leader of the pitching staff with a couple of young guys here, kind of showing them the ropes, the stuff we do around here, and kind of molding them into the culture we have built the past couple of years. Thanks.